guys. I don't know if you can tell, but it's windy out here. I keep having to like play with this here. Uh, the wind gusts, we've talked about them being on and off. Right now, uh, they're very much on. Uh, I don't know how to test the wind like people do. Uh, I don't know how to do that. But you know what? This is something you're going to have to watch out for this morning is those wind gusts. We do have a wind advisory in effect until 10 a.m. These are going to be on all of our passes, all of our major passes, like the 178, the 14, the 58. The grapevine is actually looking pretty clear and doesn't look too bad for travel this morning. They are not part of this wind advisory on that on the list that I saw this morning. But you know what? Right now, the 58, seeing some wind. So you're just going to be have to, you're going to have to be careful driving out here just because uh, it gets hard when the wind is there to keep both your hands on the wheel. And sometimes you can feel your car veering. Just be very cognizant when you're driving by those big rigs because they do have a little bit more trouble staying up and uh, wavering around when that wind comes by. You know what, you guys, this is just the start of some wild weather we're expecting. We're expecting some rain and snow depending on your elevations tomorrow. But this is just a great time to get prepared because there is no precipitation on the ground at this time get prepared make sure you've got that winter preparedness kit in your car blankets food uh, dry clothes and all of that stuff flashlights and also make sure your home is prepared if we're gonna get any of that rain make sure you've got your sandbags your flashlights in case anything goes wrong there you guys just a good reminder to get prepared this morning while there is still no rain and snow for you live in Tatchby, between La Nugent, 23 ABC Good advice there. You can see uh, here's the wind just blowing up there into Hatchby. Thank you, Tweelon. And don't forget to stick with 23ABC News as we track the weather and conditions all weekend. We'll have updates on our free mobile and tablet apps as well as on our website, turn to 23.com. It's all part of 23ABC News being your official El Nino season station.